Every day I am getting about 50 or more messages about sharing more motivational and inspirational stories and talks. Despite busy life, I think I owe a debt and duty of giving back to the society. So I'm sharing another thought which you all must remember to maintain quality of your lives. There was a group of highly established alumni who got together to visit their old university professor. The conversation among them, you know, soon turned into complaints about their stressful pressures of work and life. The professor went to the kitchen and returned with a large pot of coffee and an assortment of cups including gold-plated, silver-plated, plastic, glass, crystal, some plain-looking, some expensive and some exquisite cups. The professor told them to help themselves to the coffee. After all the students had a cup of coffee in their hands, the professor said, did you notice all the nice looking cups are taken and only the, the plain inexpensive ones are left behind. While it is you know, normal for everyone to want the best for themselves, but that is the source of problems and stress in your professional lives and perhaps even in your personal lives, said the professor. The cup itself adds no quality to the coffee. In most of the cases, it's just more expensive and hides what we drink, said the professor. What all of you really wanted was, said the professor, what all of you wanted was the coffee and not the cup. But all of you consciously went for good-looking expensive cups and then be began eyeing each other's uh, cups. Let's consider that life is the coffee and the jobs, career positions, houses, cars, material things and money are the cups. The type of cup we have does not define or change the quality of our lives. Yes. So what is the takeaway of this, this uh, short illustration which I just gave. What is the takeaway? You know, sometimes we fail to enjoy the coffee by concentrating only on the cup, only on the cup which contains the coffee, which we have. Your quality of life is coffee which you lose sight of by just concentrating on materialistic stuff. Quality of life does not lie or can be found only in your careers, jobs or the houses you have. It is within you. It is within you and, and not outside. So follow your passion and hobbies now and then to get the most desirable, to get the most desirable pleasures out of life. Never lose sight of your passion and hobbies while you keep on working. Bye for now.